This procedure begins with the mating of two genetically different haploid yeast cells. Diploids are selected by replica plating onto medium that permits growth of only the diploids. The diploids are then patched onto sporulation plates or ASCII form. The ASCII are dissected with the haploids placed in a defined location on the plate. Once the resulting haploids have grown to a visible colony, the plate is replicated to selective medium to identify the genotype of the individual cells. Hi, I'm Adrian Morris. And I'm Audrey Mahe, and we're from the laboratory of Dr. Michael Satcher at the University of Concordia in Montreal. Today we will show you a procedure for the dissection of yeast ASCII that are usually referred to as tetrads. We use this procedure in our laboratory to construct haploid yeast strains with novel genotypes and to study the effects of mixing two mutations together. So let's get started. To construct a diploid strain, two haploid strains of opposite mating types are mated. The haploid strains are first struck out on appropriate media, YPD in our case, to produce single colonies. Using a sterile inoculation loop, pick a small portion of a colony from one of the two haploid strains. On a new YPD plate, streak the loop once in a straight line across the plate. Mark the direction of the streak with an arrow on the bottom of the plate. Next, pick a small portion of a colony from the other haploid strain. On the same YP